Okay, <laughs> how are you? Okay, my name is uh, Bruce Talawaima. I'm a DJ at the KUI I Hopi Station, which is located on the Hopi Reservation. And we play all sorts of music. In the mornings, we usually play a lot of native songs, mostly Hopi. And this is an extra large? Good. Good evening. Uh, my name is Randall Molly, and I'm a DJ for the Hopi Radio KUII 88.1 FM, and we stream online at KUII.net and KUII, KUII's uh, foundation of the Hopi Nation. And uh, I work in the morning as a DJ from 6 to 8 o'clock, and I do a Tatawi program, which is nothing but Native American Indian music. So make sure you tune in to KUII 88.1 FM. Yeah, well, why don't you tell people where you're at when you say the Hopi Reservation? Okay, we're, kind of we're located in Kings Canyon, Arizona, which is in the northeastern part of Arizona. And most of our programming, my, myself and Randall's, are in our native language. I, I speak mostly Hopi on the air in the morning show, and Randall has the uh, <laughs> gift of speaking two languages. Yeah, I, I uh, use also both Hopi uh, language and the Tewa language and English language. And, <laughs> oh, and, and so the Tewas actually do have their own language, and I did not, something yeah. I've learned. Okay. Right, right, they do. And, and I've always heard, and I may be wrong, that Walpi was a Tewa village. Is that true or not? Uh, yeah, uh, Walpi, no. it's, uh, it's on the same mesa. Oh, is same that the deal? On, it's on the, the Tewa is on the eastern part of the... Uh, oh, so that's what it is. There's right. Tewa and Hopi up there no, on the three, hill. three villages on First Mesa. There's the Tewa, Sichumobi, and Walpi. Oh, okay. And Walpi's Hopi? Uh, Walpi and Sichumobi are Hopi. They're all Hopi. Tewa's yeah. Tewa. And, Tewa and, and I did not know that. And that's Tewa interesting is, to uh, learn. From, kind of like from New Mexico. Yeah, yeah. And the, and the Tewa's came to New Mexico, I think, back during the... Uh, Pueblo Wars, it might have been something. They got kind of chased. Chased over there from, I know a bit of history, but I do a blog about this stuff too, guys. So what we're doing now is we're doing a lot of remotes. So we're right now in Flagstaff, Arizona at the Hopi Hearts Festival. So we, we're, that's, an, that's one thing that we're doing a lot more now is going out to the community events to broadcast live. Are you, yeah, they won't let you do it at the dances, will they? No, no, not no. that. No, not they the won't Hopi let you. Dances. Not the Hopi dances. No, yeah, they won't the, let uh, you do Hopi that. Traditional dances, just like events of the like the Hopi Love Reservation, yeah. we do remote so that uh, a lot of our people that don't get away uh, from the reservation to come here, we uh, uh, broadcast it on live for them at the radio so they can listen to what's going on. Cool. The, the um, yeah, there's one thing you won't find on the internet is a Hopi dance. Thank you. you will not find like right. a, you will right. not find right. a Hopi right. dance. Right. And I was I was up at you just will not find them. Yeah. Okay. And which is kind of good that yeah. people are screening everybody right. and making sure because I was just up at K Town with my buddy yeah. Akima, and um, they you're just you're not going to record anything. And I was up at uh, at Old Arriba the year before to a dance up there, and there was just nothing. And what's interesting, and I always tell people. <laughs> You can go to a dance, like the dancers we had here earlier have their own style, but if you go to a dance on the Hopi in the villages, mm -hmm. there ain't nothing like nothing. it. Right. And there ain't no rhythm like it either. Right. They got the most unique rhythm you ever heard. You, nobody's got you know, the African rhythms and all that kind of stuff like that, but the Hopi rhythm is unique and, and the voices are unique. Uh -huh. and, and it's history. <clears throat> and, and it's Hopi history is what it is. And so one of the things that, that we would encourage us that now that we're streaming online at www.kuii.net, so you have an opportunity now to listen on internet, which is something that's new for KUII. So we, we encourage. Everybody. And you know, you guys could hook up a web camera and you could go live on live stream, which is on the internet. Okay. And, like, and I, I do interviews on the internet myself, okay. Okay. and you can actually hook a web camera up and you could broadcast the world on live stream You're, because there's several radio shows that are on live stream uh -huh. and, and it takes absolutely nothing because you can just get a Logitech webcam for about $35 stick it on top of your PC because that's where you're broadcasting anyway and put yourself out to the world your faces and you could even have guests come on with their Kachina dolls and whatever their artwork yeah, yeah, yeah. and it's and this guy here this is, is this guy your tech guy no he's our station manager he's your state well and he's your tech right 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 kind of basically he's not yeah. one of the uh, DJs then well he does do, he does do that every once in a while 
Yeah, he didn't want to be on here, but I'm gonna put him on here anyway, so everybody sees him. And let, you let can the world, see me working. You can see his shirt mainly we like here. But anyway, yeah, you guys can then I'll show you I'll give you the, the link to how to get to it. Okay, so, Frank. Yeah, this is really great folks, and here we are from the Museum hey, of Northern Arizona, of course. Hey, and give um, these guys a shot. God bless right? them. Thanks guys. Thank you very Thank much. You. Okay, cool. Um,